Okay, so now we're going to continue on with the third entrance into the step, which is a very, very, very nice entrance, which has a movement that's called what we call deboulés, which is, you could translate in Spanish, a vuelta, pirueta, a turn. And these are basically chain turns that continue going along. This was a movement that Antonio Torero taught to some of his more advanced students, so it's a movement that um, you'll need to practice a little bit, but it's a very, very, very nice step and very fun to do. We're going to give it to you in two options. The first is a little bit more the simple way where there's one turn for the woman. And then, of course, as you're more comfortable doing the movement, you can add more turns. We'll show you first with one turn, and then we'll show you with three turns. But of course, you can change that according to what you're comfortable with, OK? The basic idea here is, is that we start going to three of the basic with the woman. One, two, and three. Now here, I need to send the woman out a little bit ahead of me. So how am I going to do this? A little bit with my left arm, I'm going to send her out. She has good tension here resisting to my arm. So from here, I'm going to send her one, two, three, four, and she comes this way. Basically what's going to happen here, this was to demonstrate to you the leading of the movement here. Now we're going to check exactly what it is that the feet of the man do because there's a particular rhythm here that we need to keep. So we have Boom, one, two, three, four, and we catch the woman's arm. It's very important that if we look here alone, what the man is going to do, he's going to come this way. He goes to three, sends the woman out, and one, two, three, four. Notice what happens here that I accompany the woman sideways. I'm walking this way. So at a certain point, I have to change a little bit my front. And that also helps to send the woman out in the turn. So from here, this is linear. From here, I send her out one, two, three, four. It's important that this hand, always in the way that Antonio taught it, was that the arm is just relaxed here. And this, we don't want the arm stretched. We want a, just a very nice elastic arm here, because later we're going to need to utilize it to, to guide the woman to come in. OK? So from here, the basic idea is we send the woman out. She goes turning, and we follow her. So one, two, three, and? We catch her arm right here. We're then going to bring her in a little bit. The idea is to guide this foot forward, and then at the same moment to turn her and to embrace her here. So it's sort of two movements that are happening. We guide her forward, and then we turn her. Then we step up to actually embrace her there. That's the first option. That's with um, just one turn, with one déboulé. And if it helps you, we're going to count it a little bit so that you can practice it very well. So the basic idea would be one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. That would be the counts there. Now, once you've practiced this, you become used to the movement, we're going to add three turns for the woman. Basically, nothing changes for the man. The timing is going to stay exactly the same, except, of course, since there are three turns, the distance that will be traveled will be a little bit more. But basically, for the man, nothing really changes. So we're going to start a little bit more back here. Do have a little bit more space? See? And we have one, two, three, four, five, and we come right here. Obviously, you can see that there's a little bit more energy that goes into this because it's important to know how will the woman know how many turns she has to do. In the original way, you see I don't give her so much energy. It's just it's enough just to turn, but not so much. From here, boom. That's enough. Now, if I want to give a little bit more energy so that she knows how many turns to do, it's going to be a bit more. And one, two, three, four, and I bring her in here and embrace her very well. See? OK, so now we've explained the man's part and all of the very complicated leading that goes into this particular step here. And we're going to uh, talk about how the woman is going to follow this particular step because she has to be quite sensitive to feel exactly all the leading that happens here. And we're also going to count for you exactly the counts, all of the movements that the woman does, so that will be a little bit easier for you to practice them later. OK? We're going to show it once again from this angle here. Basically, the woman is going to start by doing three of the basic step. One, two, and three. Here she's going to go out a little bit with her right leg. You see that already she opens out. And here, basically, she's going to do the déboulés, which she turns, opens. She turns one more time. 
And here she just simply crosses the foot a little bit in front. Okay, so that's the feet. That's what's happening here with the feet. Now we need to look exactly what happens with the arms. That's something that's very important of how the woman is going to place her arms. There are many different options here. There's no one way to do it. There's many different ways that you can do it. For example, the woman can place the arms this way. Boom. Open. And on the hips. Or she can place them this way. See? That's another option that she has as well. Or she can place them on the hips and maintain one on the hip as she opens out. There's different options that she has there as well. Why don't we see the way that Cecilia does them here? Because she has a very good use of the arms. See, we'll do one turn first. The arms, they cross behind. This she opens out. She has a good um, bend here of the arm so the arm isn't stiff this way. That we don't want. That would lock the shoulder too much. So here she has a very elastic, very relaxed arm. Now here, when she feels the lead for the man to guide her in, she feels it on the hand and she steps a little bit opening the body. You notice that here she opens the body a bit because the idea is she's coming towards the man. From here he's going to turn her. She places her arm above and then she brings it in this way. So once again, if we notice this, how she places the arm above, not underneath, she places it above the hand here to then take the man to do the embrace. So from here, it comes above him. She feels here the contact, of course, with the shoulder blade, and then the arm here. The step would be counted this way if we did one turn. It would be as follows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. That would be the idea there. Now, what's going to happen if we want to do three deboles, if we want to do three vueltas, if we want to do a few more turns? Basically, everything is going to stay the same here. The only thing that's going to change is the speed. Whereas before, we did very relaxed turns, dun, 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 this way. Now we're going to have to take it a little bit faster, and they're going to turn into this. One, two, three, four, five, and. So the speed needs to go just a little bit up. And also the feet are going to become smaller, the positions of the feet. So instead of being so open, they're going to be a little bit more closed. Let's see how Cecilia does it. And, bum, 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 bum. She comes in, and we embrace. So, do you think you've practiced enough? <laughs> Okay, well now you have all the details that you need to be able to do the turns very well. We're going to show them to you, the two versions that we gave you with one turn or with three turns. We're going to show it to you first of all in slow motion, which isn't always that easy to do, but it's good to practice the movement slowly. We're going to show it to you that way slowly, then in real time, and then we'll show you the version with the three turns, once again in slow motion and then in real time, okay? So, first we'll do one turn in slow motion. And there we go, to embrace the woman here, okay? Now let's do it a little bit more in the time that we could apply to the dancing. And there we go, okay? Now we're going to really do the three turns, but a little bit slower, very controlled, with a lot of control. Okay. And now we'll do them with power. And there we go. Deboles.